Hey everybody, I just want to show you a quick example of what a bad tank heater looks like. This is the heater that was in my uh, 40 breeder black ghost knife fish tank and the reason I had it at an angle instead of upright in the corner, I usually like my hardware out of the way so you can't see it. Uh, this is a 300 watt heater, it's a pretty big one. And I noticed there was some condensation, little droplets of water inside of it. And when I actually pulled it out today, you can see that has quite a lot of water in it. So this is a very, very dangerous situation. I got really, really lucky and nothing happened. Uh, one of the things that can happen is when the heater comes on, the water will boil. It can actually shatter the glass. You can get electrocution of your fish. You know, you can have a short circuit. There's all sorts of things that can go wrong when you have water inside an electrical component. So if you ever do see water inside your tank heater, you need to unplug it immediately and get it out of your tank. I didn't get it out of the tank immediately, but I did unplug it. Once it's unplugged, it's safe. It's, you know, it's not going to do anything. Uh, I did just install the new heater, but I also wanted to say that I had a few people talk to me about seeing some condensation in the heater as normal. And occasionally you will see tiny, tiny little drops of water on the inside of the glass. It would, it would look more like the way you would see fog on a windshield uh, rather than actual water like this. I did call Aquatop and talk to them directly and they said that a tiny bit of moisture inside the glass is not that uncommon there is air in there and as it heats and cools you will get condensation from the moisture that's trapped inside but anything approaching this is i mean if you see even enough condensation that it's dripping and puddling into the bottom and there's only even a few little drops of water that have collected in the bottom that's more water than you should see inside of one of these this is you know way way beyond safe so i got really lucky it failed but it failed in the sense that it shut off and did not work and my tank went down to room temperature which is not that big a deal uh, a lot of people have heaters that fail and they get stuck on and they wind up cooking their fish so i got really lucky i didn't know this had gone bad i don't know how long it had been bad but i did notice that the tank seemed a little cooler than usual lately and that's when I really looked in and had a close look at the heater and I saw that condensation, or so I thought it was condensation inside. And now that I've pulled it out and looked in there, clearly it is time to go. So that's going in the trash. The new heater's already in there. Thanks for watching this one. I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're not already. That way you'll get any other little oddball videos like this that I shoot from time to time. So thanks again for watching. Hope that helps somebody. And I'll see you real soon in the next one.